What's up, YouTube? It's your boy T Sizzle back for another video. And for today's video, this is gonna be a video request of DTGN. Um, he had a request talking about how old people think they deserve respect just because they're old. Now, I had a video talking about this, but uh, I I'm having a hard time finding it, but I'm gonna just do it over again. Maybe I can add some new points to it or whatever, but I don't know. But yeah, that is a uh, common thing that older people expect. They expect just because they're older that they automatically deserve respect. They think it's just, just because their skin is wrinkled and they lived on this world a long time that for some reason you're supposed to honor them or something like that. And it's like, I disagree. It's like, oh, 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 well, you know, I lived on this planet for 80 years. It's like, okay, what did you do on this planet that I need to give you respect for? Well, you know, all I did was just kiss my boss's ass and work a job every day, be a slave, never, never take a stand against nothing. I never took a stand against, you know, inflation or anything. All I did was go to work, let someone tell me what to do, be in doctrine. And I just didn't do anything besides have kids, bring kids into the world. And I just didn't contribute any good thing to this planet at all. So yeah, you need to respect me. It's like, no, I'm not respecting you for that. <laughs> And um, I even heard that, like, you know, in the African, you know, like in African families that that mindset is even more prevalent, and, you know, in African families. It's like, oh, you need to respect me and shit, you know, all that dumb shit. It's like, no, bro. And like, I, I used to follow that shit. I used to follow, oh, respect your elders and shit. And I used to believe that the older generation was smarter than the than the younger generation, and that's that's not true, because, you know, realistically speaking, us being Generation Z, we're way smarter than the older generation because number one, we have the internet, and number two, what worked back in the nineteen fifties doesn't work now. So if they give you some advice, it's outdated. It's outdated. They, so most of the time, they really can't tell you nothing, anyways. You know, anytime that, I, that I've talked to like an old person, all, they say the same repeated washed up advice. Oh, stay in school, go to college, get a good job. I mean, that's all they say. Get married, have some kids. That's all they say. Like, I don't think it's like an old person that gave me like some thought provoking advice. Like, oh, that was actually good, right? No, they, they all say the same shit because they're all NPCs. They're all sheeps. So they're going to they tell you the same bullshit. All of them go to church. They all do the same shit. There, there, there's nothing special about them. You know, I, I don't believe in that. Oh, just because you're old, I got to respect you. You know what I'm saying? Now, of course, you should be respectful to, to you know, to everybody. I, I ain't saying go to old person, be an asshole. But for me to have this great appreciation for you, it's like, no, I don't know. You have to earn that shit. You have to, you know, I, I have to admire you. You have to have done things in your life. That make me respect you. You ain't you ain't do shit. You know that's why it's 2024, and the world's still fucked up because y'all ain't do shit to change this fucked up world. So, so y'all can kiss my ass with the oh I'm old so respect me bullshit. I don't want to hear that shit. You know like you know like these old people think think they're all high and mighty like, you know like when I get old. I, I'm not going to have that mindset. Oh, I'm old. You know, y'all got to respect me. No, you don't got to respect shit. <laughs> you know, you don't even know me like that. You know, it's just ridiculous. Like, seriously, like if you was to have a time machine and see these old people when they were our age, all they did was just work, 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 Slave, 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 and then fucking grow old, have kids, and that's it. I mean, you ain't even do shit with your life. You just did some sheep shit. Why am I going to respect that for? I'm tired of that old people shit. Like, it, these old people are a joke, man. You know? <laughs> you know? I'm tired of that shit, bro. Oh, I'm old. Respect me. And like I said, like, it's... And that's definitely in the black community, too. These old people can't tell you shit. About life, bro. They can't. 
they gonna give you some sheep, you know, some fucking outdated bullshit that doesn't apply. Oh, get married and all that dumb shit. I don't care about that shit, bro. So, man, fuck these old ass motherfuckers that say that shit. Just because you're old doesn't mean you're smart. Just because you're old doesn't mean you're special. Because, you know, when you see a dumbass and you say, oh, yeah, that nigga's a dumbass. Well, that same dumbass can grow old. That same idiot can grow old. And does that mean he's worthy of respect? No. These older people, they didn't leave behind any generational wealth. They didn't leave behind, you know, property like houses or anything for their future generation. They ain't do shit. All they did was have kids while they were broke. And then the new generation has to struggle so hard just just to just to escape their situation. You know, these people ain't do nothing. Ain't do none of that. They ain't do that. They knew that, that the entire world revolves around money, but yet they didn't think, okay, maybe I should create some generational wealth for my kids and kids, 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 kids. They ain't do that shit. They ain't do it. They, they, they had kids while they was in poverty. I already talked about this in a previous video, how especially in the black community, all of us got the same story. Oh, you know, raised on ramen noodles, raised on hot dogs, raised on, you know, food stamps, section eight. I mean, it's the same thing. You go to any black person all throughout America, they all going to tell you the same thing, how they was raised. R ramen noodles, hot dogs, bologna sandwich. It's the same shit. It's the same, same, uh, different area, same shit. And that's how it's been like, it's, it's, it's been like that for years, man. You know, the the previous generation before me was raised on that shit. The, before them, they was raised on that shit. Like, it's the same thing. Nothing has changed. No one in the... No one in the family tries to break this cycle, break this generational curse of the same shit. Born broke. These people keep having kids. They don't got no damn money. And I'm supposed to respect you for that. Get the hell out of my face with that bullshit. Okay, I'll respect you if you got some generational wealth. If you can cash at me $200,000, 500K, then I respect you because you, cause you, cause you know, at least you made a success out of yourself. And you passing that shit on to me, even though I still don't like that I'm born in this world, you know, I respect that. But if you ain't if you ain't do that, then fuck you. Cause now I gotta do all this shit, you know, that I shouldn't have to do. <laughs> you know? I shouldn't have to, you know, fucking, you know, make a video talking about, oh yo, can y'all donate a dollar a month? I mean, I shouldn't have to do that. You know, if I had generational wealth, I you know, I wouldn't have to do that. So y'all ain't fucking do shit. So fuck y'all old motherfuckers, man. Y'all ain't y'all ain't shit. Pfft, respect me because I'm old. Fuck y'all, dude. So damn retarded. Fuck I say I'm out.